One thing I'm gonna do with our girls, I'm gonna build so much confidence in them. I'm gonna praise them so much, almost to a fault, but I am gonna make sure that they have self-esteem like no other kid. So if they wanted to do something that no one else did, or they wanted to go against the grain, go against the crowd, they would feel comfortable doing it. At the end of the day, what's most important, you have integrity, you're comfortable in your own skin no matter what that is, and you live by your own terms and God's terms. Good morning, Mommy. It's 5.20 in the morning. Let's go home. I see Mickey now. <laughs> What are we eating today? <laughs> huh, what are we eating? <laughs> We're eating this five bar along with some banana. Hi, Okazaimas. Had a great night with this one. Slept like rocks. You know what that? Take your five bar. <laughs> hey. Getting ready for the marathon tomorrow. I'm gonna prepare all day today. I'm gonna make some eggs for us too. Okay. You get the egg for yourself. <laughs> you think you're funny? Are you funny? When I get the both of the granola. No! <laughs> <laughs> we got home last night like 11, which means it was 2 a.m. on the I, East Coast. I ate it. Feeling good now. <laughs> French style omelet with avocados. Scale of 1 to 10, how is it? Mm. Mm. That's not. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Tiffany! Hi. You guys might remember her from such events as her wedding. <laughs> yep. And um, Ragnar, she's gonna be helping me. Anything you wanna say to the vlog? Just good luck, Benji. He's gonna rock it. <laughs> no, he's not. Bikers. <laughs> I love it. I love people. It turned into a doggy. It was such a smooth flight, and I'm glad everything went well. Unfortunately, Auntie Mo was split up from us, but everything was smooth. Like, the girls were very well behaved, and. Kira didn't get sick again. <laughs> Anyways, I'm really exhausted. It's only noon. The twins and I are gonna go down for an NAP here soon. Daddy is out with Auntie Tiff. I don't know if Benji vlogged with Tiffany, but his cousin is in town for the marathon. Juliana, look, a pink lemon. I know it doesn't look pink, but the inside of this lemon is pink, like your shirt. And look at these grapes. Look how funny these grapes look. Uh, which finger Daddy, grapes? Ooh, that's kind of a weird name. Oh, are these cherries from Washington? Yeah! We got cherries, little one! Yeah! <laughs> so Juliana's been napping well over an hour. Mia has been napping for half an hour, and Kira is so wide awake. She's just singing in the room and I had to separate them because they were just not going down and I could see how exhausted Mia was, like her, her eyes. So we've been up since 2 o'clock our time and it's 4 p.m. right now. Kira still has not slept. She only slept for an hour in the plane. She's gonna be so exhausted. <laughs> Let's go downstairs. Let me see your eyes. Are you tired? Are you tired? Okay, let's go downstairs, sweetie. Let's go. Kara, you want to sleep in your room? Do you want apples? So tomorrow's Father's Day or by the time you're watching this, it's Father's Day and I edited a video for Benji looking back at some of my favorite moments of him as a father and some of the messages that he had for the girls 
and I was crying. I was like legit crying last night editing this. Another message of future Benji is remember how good of a feeling you have or you had when you were with Juliana at this age. Like how precious and how priceless it is to you and how good you feel when she is learning new things and she's being cute. And remember that one time she comes up to you and she goes, Give me a kiss, give me a kiss, Aww. and then kiss you on the lips. Remember I know, that. I'm like, she's already growing so fast. <laughs> Alright, little boy, come on. Let's show the world what we've been practicing. There you go, good. Good. Very nice. Other leg. Come on, <laughs> little one. <laughs> I used to keep a journal, and I loved reading them, but now, Judy and I, we have video journal to be able to look back on our lives. I'm gonna really cherish hanging out with Kira right now, and Mia. <laughs> if you use cloth diapers, you don't have the rashes. One thing I'm gonna do with our girls, I'm gonna build so much confidence in them. I'm gonna praise them so much, almost to a fault, but I am gonna make sure that they have self-esteem like no other kid. So if they wanted to do something that no one else did, or they wanted to go against the grain, go against the crowd, they would feel comfortable doing it. At the end of the day, what's most important, you have integrity, you're comfortable in your own skin, no matter what that is, and you live by your own terms and God's terms. Okay, so I'm gonna record a little something from the girls today, like just a short message, and add it to the video. Seattle, home of the Seahawks, home of the Mariners. So I'm coming down here to the marathon rock and roll marathon and we're gonna get our our bibs it's like the numbers that we wear while we're running by the time you watch this i will be done with the marathon you can see the, all the posts on instagram and you guys can check out what my time is i'll post it but I'm excited did you draw a picture inside for papa go draw a picture anything you want okay are you good job what does Papa like to do? No, not on the head. On your flowers. Mommy, make a jacket. Okay, okay let me gonna, see. I'm making my jacket. Oh, what does Papa like to do? Here, here, here. 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 Here,
something real quick. <laughs> Why were you guys crying? Because I lost you. Why didn't you look for me before you started crying? Mommy, I was want you to see down up downstairs. I know. I just had to fix something on my computer real quick. No, I did me up, I bleed. Did you clean up your toys downstairs? Mm -hmm. I don't want to clean up toys. Okay, then you don't have to watch iPad. Oh, we asked. It says marathon on there my bib. I've never had that. Only 6% of the population. <laughs> Let's make that 7 or 8 or 9 or 10. Are coming out to watch you? Uh, yeah, there are some people. My dad's over there and he, he used to run marathons at 2 hours and 52 minutes. So. Well, those people make me sick. <laughs> Happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. And hopefully you guys have a great rest of your Sunday. We'll see you tomorrow.